Hello, you're welcome to solve this math problem, which is 4 power of x minus 4 power of y is equal to 48. 2 power of x plus y is equal to 32. To find the value of x and y from these two systems of equations. Now, in the first step, we'll start by letting this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. Then, from equation 1, which is 4 power of x, 4 is same as 2 square, then bracket power of x minus 4 power of y, 4 is same as 2 square, then bracket power of y is equal to 48. Then in the next step, we'll take power of x inside power of 2 outside the bracket. So it will be 2 power of x bracket power of 2 outside the bracket minus 2 power of y inside the bracket bracket power of 2 outside the bracket is equal to 48. Then in the next step, from equation 2, which is 2 power of x plus y is equal to 32, 2 power of x plus y is same as 2 power of x times 2 power of y is equal to 32. Then from here, 2 power of x is common and also 2 power of y is common. So we we'll let a is equal to 2 power of x and b is equal to 2 power of y. Then from this equation, this you can let as equation 3 and this as equation 4. Then from equation 3, this 2 power of x is a, so it will be a square minus 2 power of y is b, so it will be minus b square. So it will be a square minus b square is equal to this, which is 48. Then from equation 4, it will be 2 power of x is a, 2 power of y is b. So it will be a times b is equal to 32. So a, b is equal to 32. Then from these two equations, we'll find the value of a and b. Now from this first equation, which is a square minus b square, this is in the form of a perfect square. So it will be a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket is equal to this 48 then in the next step we will square in both sides then when we take this square inside the bracket it will be this which is a plus b bracket square then times this a minus b bracket square is equal to 48 square then we'll expand a plus b bracket square it will be a square plus 2ab plus b square bracket then bracket a minus b bracket square is same as a square minus 2ab plus b square bracket is equal to this which is 48 square then in the next step it will be this a square plus b square then plus this 2ab bracket bracket this plus this a square plus b square then minus this 2ab bracket is equal to 48 square then from here we can place the here bracket and here we can place bracket a square b square a square b square then plus this 2ab minus 2ab now this is also in the form of a perfect square so it will be this which is a square plus b square then bracket square then minus this which is 2ab bracket square is equal to 48 square then in the next step will it will be a square plus b square bracket square will be found in a square plus b square because we don't know then minus 2 times a b a b from here a b is 32 so it will be times 32 
then bracket square is equal to 48 square then it will be a square plus b square bracket square is equal to this 48 square we take this 2 times 32 is 64 so 64 square in here we have negative so we take, when you take in, into this side it will be plus 64 square then it will be a square plus b square bracket square is equal to 48 square plus 64 square is 6400 then in the next step we'll apply square root in both sides so this square square root will cancel square then it will be a square plus b square is equal to square root of 64 is 8 and this square root of this double zero is, is single zero so in here to be plus or minus now in here we have two solutions because of plus or minus but a square is positive value b square is positive value so the sum will be positive value then this negative value will reject it then we'll consider the equation which is a square plus b square is equal to 80 then from from this equation in the next step we will apply the rule which is a plus b bracket square is equal to a square plus b square then plus 2ab to find the value of a plus b so it will be a plus b bracket square is equal to a square plus b square is 80 so it will be 80 then plus 2 times a b a b from here a b it is 32 so it will be times 32 then it will be a plus b bracket square is equal to 30, 32 times 2 is 64 64 plus 80 it will be 4 6 plus 8 is 14 then in the next step we'll apply square root in both sides so this square root will cancel square then it will be a plus b is equal to plus or minus square root of this is 12 then from here we have two solutions plus because of plus or minus but we recall in here we let a a is 2 power of x and b is 2 power of y so from a is 2 power of x and b is equal to 2 power of y so 2 power of any number is positive value and 2 power of any number is positive value so this it will be positive value and this is positive value so a is greater than 0 and b is greater than 0 therefore the sum of numbers which are greater than 0 is positive value so reject this negative value therefore it will be a plus b is equal to 12 then from this a plus b is equal to 12 we'll find a minus b so as you can solve simultaneous equation then from here we'll apply rule which is a plus b bracket square minus a minus b bracket square is equal to 4ab then in the next step from here a plus b is 12 so it will be 12 square then minus a minus b bracket square is equal to 4 times ab ab it is 32 from here it is 32 then it will be 12 square is 144 minus a minus b bracket square is equal to 4 times 2 is 8 4 times 3 is 12 then we'll take this into this side it will be 144 minus 128 is equal to this negative taken to this side to be positive a minus b bracket square so it will be this which is a minus b bracket square is equal to 
144 minus 128 it will be 14 14 minus 8 is 6 in here it will be 13 13 minus 12 is 1 then we'll apply square root in both sides so this square root will cancel square then it will be a minus b is equal to square root of 4 64 16 is plus or minus 4 then from here we have two solution because of plus or minus then we we'll recall before here a is greater than 0 and b is greater than 0 so a minus b it will be greater than 0 so reject this negative value therefore it will be a minus b is equal to 4 then from here a minus b is equal to 4 then we take this equation a plus b is equal to 12 so a plus b is equal to 12 then we we'll solve this continuous equation by elimination so we'll add these two equations a plus a is 2a negative b plus b is 0 is equal to 4 plus 12 is 16 then we divide by 2 in both sides this and this will cancel then it will be a is equal to 16 divided by 2 is 8 so from here we get the value of a to find the value of b from here a minus b is equal to 4 we substitute the value of a which is 8 8 minus b is equal to 4 then in here it will be b is equal to when we take b into this side it will be positive then 4 we take into this side it will be 8 minus 4 is 4 so it will be b is equal to 4 then from here a is then we recall before we let a is 2 power of x so from a a which is 2 power of x is equal to a is 8 then it will be 2 power of x is equal to 8 is 2 power of 3 now they have same base so we'll compare the powers then it will be x is equal to 3 so this is the final answer for the value of x then from b is equal to 4 then b was 2 power of y so it will be b which is 2 power of y is equal to b which is 4 then it will be 2 power of y is equal to 4 which is 2 power of 2 now we have same base so we'll compare the powers then to be y is equal to 2 so this is the final answer for the value of y therefore x is equal to 3 y is equal to 2 now to check if our answers are correct from just one equation we can take this which is is equation 2 power of x plus y is equal to 32 from 2 power of x plus y is equal to 32 we substitute the value of x it will be 2 power of x x is 3 so 3 plus y is 2 so it will be plus 2 is it equal to 32 then it will be 2 power of 3 plus 2 is power of 5 is equal to 2 power of 5 is equal to 32. Now left side and right side are equal. Then it is 2 for the value of x is 3 and value of y is 2. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.